We're here because the very good folk in Australia made, and you being straight you know how the high quality products that uh, we were able to produce over there. Uh, and it's important though, in order to get the real stuff. So kind of like, you know the big brand stuff that you seem right. to gravitate to a little more than others? It seems like yeah. you enjoy the branding. Well, in order to get the absolute authentic uh, Australian made stuff, it's all about this little triangle. Mm. If it's got that on it, you know what I mean? Yeah, it was magic. Authentic, mm. that's right. So what we've got here, we've got some authentic Australian products. And what we would like to do is introduce you to them, but also just maybe try and identify the product with a player on your team mm. that would most appreciate a bit of Australia. Yeah. So we're gonna start off first. Mm. Now this is a pure, genuine leather belt with just you know a bit of decoration of that mm -hmm. going on. Who do you reckon can rock Ooh. the Australian made leather belt? Uh, I think this, I think it'd be someone like Shea, who wears a lot of nice clothes, um, likes dressing up, and I think right. something like this is something he could pull off, not yeah. something I could pull off, so um, I have to definitely hand it to him. The other one now is we've got, now, toiletry kits, mm. which we are, you're on the road a lot, yep. you need to have your toiletry, and you need to throw in the Australian made skincare products. Mm -hmm. So you've got this <laughs> beautiful leather, leather uh, Australian yeah. made toiletry, and your skincare. Beautiful. Who perhaps, you know, is a bit more self-conscious about what's mm. going on than takes I care mean, of yourself? Toiletry bag, very necessary when you're going on the road. Yep. Um, as you know, I've got one right here with me. So, yeah. um, geez, I think this could this could be good for me. Uh, I like to carry my stuff around with me mm. after games when you get out of the shower. Yep. Um, so this is definitely something I could take. Well, you can take that. And, and the skincare, who perhaps spends just that, maybe the, mm. a touch too long in front of the mirror? That type of guy, that uh, just, you know. I reckon Aaron Wiggins. I reckon he spends a lot of time looking at himself in the mirror. We so uh, this could definitely be good for him. Now. This is mm. as authentic and Australian as it gets. It the Akubra hat. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it's a, it's a, it it's a beautiful thing. Who, who you reckon could? Uh... Yeah, this one I think is definitely Kenrich, a uh, country guy from a small town called Waco, right. uh, which is in Texas, and this is definitely something I can see him wearing. Right. Um, even myself, you know, as an Australian, uh, I could definitely see myself putting this on every once in a while. Like now, lastly. Everywhere we go, uh, I know that you're a Vegemite kid. Who do you reckon would be willing to have a crack at it? Because I've yet to know anyone, any American yeah. that I've introduced Vegemite to, I've yet to know anyone that's gone, mm, mm, yeah, me tasty, yeah. this is great. I, I think I'd get Jeremiah to try it. Yeah. Uh, we close to speak about Australia a lot. So, um, I mean, all the guys, I try and get them to get, have a go at this, yeah. but. Jeremiah would be the man that I get to He's try. willing, he's sort of adventurous. I don't know, I don't know if he would. Um, I'd have to get someone that's adventurous and willing to give someone a shot. <laughs> Jeremiah would be my man for this. Well, you're on a mission to try and Australianize your team. We've given you the tools to do it. Yeah. So hopefully they can embrace it. And if they're ever looking to come in Australia and they want to uh, further their Australian experience with some of the products, it's all about the little triangle and Australia, it mate. Truly, appreciate it. Good man.